Yo, what is up YouTube? My name's Aaron and today is Wednesday and if you watched the video from yesterday, you would know what that means, gameplay day. So the gameplay obviously is going to be some of the Black Ops 3 beta. Let me tell you something. This game is amazing. I at first I was like, you know, I'm just having fun and then once you get the hang of it, once you get your gun, once you get your perks in a row, you become a beast. I'm telling you, at the beginning of the game, I was struggling to not go as negative as the game before. I'm not gonna lie, I went negative every single game at the beginning of this game. Wait till you see the live com set up for Thursday. But this game, I go 27 and 11, and I'm pretty sure I go in a merciless, which is a 10 kill streak. Um, I, you know, obviously I get the bloodthirsty with that, but we are playing on the map Hunted and a little bit of kill confirmed. So, like I said, Wednesday is gameplay day. I'm going to be talking about the gameplay, what I'm feeling. I could be throwing tips out there, whatever. So, I guess what I'm going to say about this game is use water, you know, use water to its potential. As you see, you know, you could shoot in water. It's really cool, you know, it's a good element that they added to the game. And it adds cover too, you know. It is harder to see people underneath water, you know, if it's your teammate or not. So I'm kind of always shooting anyone that's underwater with me. But as long as I'm underwater, I feel safe from, you know, everyone up above. So like you just saw, I dipped into water. I dipped into water a little bit more. And this, what I just sent out, is a vision pulse. I can actually see through the walls for a short period of time. You know, usually I can, it helps me pick up maybe one or two kills. And that's enough for me, you know. If I don't use, always use it, but you know, whenever I do, I need it to work. And sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. There are tons of specialist abilities, abilities out there and lethals. And this is the one I decided to go with because it suits my class, you know. I'm going to be releasing this class very soon, and it is so good. And as you see, the CUDA is right there is the Merciless. Um, I knew I got it. Uh, CUDA is my favorite gun thus far in Black Ops 3. So let's talk about Black Ops 3. What do you need to know about Black Ops 3? What's going to make you better at Black Ops 3? And I'm going to tell you, nothing. You're going to get on the game, and it, you're just... I'm not going to say you're going to hate it. But it's why I can understand why so many people say they do not like Black Ops 3 because it was hard. Whenever you start up the game, it's especially now if you're getting it on day one. I think I've had this for about maybe three hours now. And with that brings really try just, you know, people that really want to try hard and then people that do not want to try hard. So what you have is a mixture of people rushing at you and people camping behind. So you gotta find a way to play in between that and that's pretty much what I did this game, which was lock down a certain part of the map. And that would happen to be that building right there and into the water a little bit. And you know, I just for the video, I wanted to get out of there and start using perimeters. And you know, I found out that that did not work that much, you know. Maintaining, especially if you're playing a game like Kill Confirmed, where the spawns are absolutely crazy, maintaining an area, and especially having six cents, best perk in the game, as long as you're running hardwired, that keeps you invisible to it. And you know, a lot of people don't run that, so I'm always getting notifications, as I call it, on the minimap that shows me where people are. As you can see, the red, it helps unless they're underneath you laying in front of a door. So like I said, campers are everywhere in this game. You're gonna see me get killed from so many campers. It's just crazy. So, if you don't know, I'm just gonna point stuff out as I see it. Like I said, Wednesday is gameplay day. It's everything about what you are seeing on the screen and me reviewing. The camo that you see I am using is not necessarily a camo. This is their new 64 layer make it your own kind of design so I just threw a bunch of blood splatters and different colors and I thought it looked really cool it looked like splash paint I am even I'm pretty sure I even called it paint and I think it looks pretty cool I have a lot of fun making these camos except most of the time the camos do not work you know this happened to be a game that it did work and I think this is the only game I've actually had where my camo worked after a certain point you know whenever I first made them they kind of worked and then whenever I started changing attachments so on and so forth it just 
messed up and I don't think it's the attachments I just think it's you know it's in beta mode stuff's gonna be glitchy they don't have everything down right but very fun game this game is kind of set up right now how I a lot of people talk about ghost you basically have to be aim down sights first to get the kill now you'll see a lot of kills where I kind of hip fire then aim down sight and I kind of catch people off guard but, you know, that's because they have really bad gun skill. And the more that I play this game, unlike any other Call of Duty I've ever played, I'm calling this Midnight Release because I basically got it at midnight. And it's just any other game I've ever played on Midnight Release, the more I play, the worse I get. You know, whenever I get the game, I'm like, oh, yeah, I'm so good at this. And whenever I'm getting off, I'm like, oh my god, I hate this game, but you know, the exact opposite happened for this game, you know, I loved this game, I still love this game, I don't even want to go to sleep, I want to keep playing this game, so you know what, I am going to keep playing this game, I'm going to keep getting videos for you guys, like I said, daily uploads, tomorrow is live commentary, or throwback Thursday, in this case, it will be a live commentary, hope to see you then, I'm out.